Hello Aries. Hi Aries, how are you doing? I hope that you're well. Welcome to Sage Sunset Healing Tarot. And I'm here with your tarot message for today. This reading actually turned out to be a love reading. And I feel it is centered around two different sets. I feel like there is a reading for males and there is a reading for females, right? So let us get started with the male reading. I'm getting a feeling like the Aries I'm reading for is some kind of a leader, maybe in an army, someone that has a position of leadership. And I feel like it's strong army as if you're a general in an army, someone that is focused determined, has great intentions for what they want, has real great leadership qualities. Some of that is stable and knows how to lead. Remember that Aries are the signs that really think of themselves the most. So I think you actually got into this leadership position, Aries, just to really... To, because you believe in yourself, you believe that you can lead, you believe that you're leading in a way that is good for you as much as it is good for everyone around you. I feel like you were kind of thrust into this position, maybe elected into this leadership position, where you're elected leader. And if it is like a greater purpose, so you might be in the army or you might be in the police force. You might be a, some kind of a law enforcer. You could be a judge or a lawyer. But you're a leader, Aries. I feel like you've always had the responsibility of directing others. And you've been very successful at it. Really successful at it, actually. And that is why you can stand proudly in this position of really leading the world. Yes, so I feel like what you do... Is something that influences society on a whole, Aries. You're a commander, I feel. Like you are uni like you wear uniform to work. So let me know if I'm right or wrong in the comment section, Aries, about you. I feel like Aries, you're very grounded. Now this is for the males, but it could probably apply to the females as well. So let me know also how this really turns out for you. I feel like you're grounded in your heart space. You have values, standards, you have your boundaries intact. You know who you are and that is why you are a leader. Your values are strong, your virtues, your integrity on point. And that is why you can be trusted with a leadership position. You're also very creative. And I feel like you got this spirit of creativity from your mother. I feel like your mother is a great influence in your life. I feel like she watches over you. If she's still present in our physical plane, she watches over you. And even if she's not Aries. So I feel like this is an Aries male that has a mother that is very spiritual, very intuitive, like a loving mother. Probably your mother was a dark skinned woman and you probably the same. And she watches over you. It's like she's the one that kind of instilled some of these values that you have inside of yourself, Aries, into you. You know, she instilled these values. She wasn't too hard on you and she wasn't too soft on you. And she has a great place in your heart. Like the essence of her, you remember her beautifully. Wherever you go, your mother is always a special person to you. Right? Of course, I mean, not everyone has a great relationship with their mother. But I believe you have a special fondness for your mother because she probably is someone that has a great position as well. Maybe she's a judge or a lawyer as well. Someone very inspirational. That's your mother. So if she's not here with you, I feel like I want to tell you that she's really guiding over you and over your love life. There's a person that you're now interested in that you're kind of being compelled to go towards. Because for all of your life you've been, or for most of your life, you've been in this position of authority, leading. But maybe you've never really embraced a softer side, really, to really welcome love. And I see that you've met someone, or you've, 
you're watching someone maybe you're watching someone online like there's someone that has piqued your interest and this person reminds you of your mother there's something twinkling in you that it's just that essence of your mother in this person this is your person aries So this person that you're watching could be a water sign or an earth sign. So Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. So this is the person. Water sign, Queen of Cups, Cancerian energy. This person is also very stable, grounded, has values in themselves. They know who they are. So you're, you're watching that person and you want to welcome that kind of energy into you. And I feel like I want to tell you that your mother approves of this kind of energy. She thinks it will be very good for you to actually have such a woman in your life that will help to bring in this kind of energy. Like a twin flame love connection. Someone that will help to make you feel more balanced. Someone that is fair and good, honest, devoted to you, who is intelligent and loving, has, is actually a very successful person in their own way, will bring a lot of happiness to you. You'll feel very successful with this person, has their virtues intact. So you might want to go after this person, Aries, and offer your love to them. That's what I'm getting for you. So you're watching this person. I feel like there are other people also guiding you on how to go into this person like you're consulting with others or maybe you have some friends that are encouraging you to really go and get her you know because i see you watching her you're literally watching this person focusing your intentions maybe you're a bit nervous because it is new to you but this person will bring some balance into your life balance in you know focusing on reality really because that's your work I feel but also in a more spiritual divine side of life they will make you feel more connected to nature um, bring more love and joy and peace in your life and so you may want to end up starting a family with this person because that is the energy that they're bringing to you maybe that is sometime in the future you know so I feel strongly like Aries you want to go in and offer this person some love right Despite your sternness, I believe this person also appreciates your energy. I feel like they're sitting and waiting. They feel like you're watching them or they know because this person is also very intuitive like your mother. And so they might have an idea that you're coming in. They might know that you're watching them. Look at this. They might know that there's something, there's, there's a movement going on and someone is watching me. This person could be a blessing from the universe to you, filled with all the emotion, love that you want, someone that can hold you, bear your emotions, listen to your stories of travel across the world and all these things, right? Someone that you can really share yourself with Aries. The second part of the reading feels like, oh, before I go in, I also want to say, I feel like you're really rushing into this person because you get what you want. You take action, Aries. You know, you have a, a high sense of confidence and you're being guided to go into this person. This person could be your twin flame. I mentioned before, great love energy, a great partner could be your twin flame and you're rushing into this person. You may have just, you may have done your contemplation about it, worked out the feelings in your, in your body to see how to go in. What can I give to this person? But you're ready to move now and you're being blessed there's there's judgment here there's the arrow font so you might want to get married to this person so that's what i'm seeing so for the that's for the males right for the females female aries of course aries are full of, naturally full of themselves they love themselves that's great aries kind of put themselves first and so you naturally came out as being high maintenance the females right i'm feeling for this specific reading you're a bit high maintenance high value you don't settle for less you know what you want 
you have a strong sense of independence, groundedness, um, clear about what you want and what you don't want. And so when you're focusing on letting in what you want, I feel you do get what you want. And it's been it's just a natural part of who you are. You're very intuitive as well, female Aries. Very intuitive. You, I feel like you create the lifestyle that you want. So because you're naturally high value, you came in knowing who you are. You may be, you may be in law as well. You may be a lawyer. You know, you may hold a very high position in life. Very stern. And you are manifesting from that place of stability to raise your values. Coming together with your sense of worthiness. Could be financially as well. And so, because of your high sense of value, you manifest from a more stable place. You manifest from from your 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 podium your throne right the queen of swords you may be feeling a bit lonely now and wanting to attract a partner to you which is this king of pentacles energy i feel like you want to attract this person to you someone who is also high value highly valuable someone who will value you and it's also the same with um with the males. This person could be your twin flame. Like a real lover's card. Amazing. You have the ace of cups here. So this is what you're looking forward to. Someone who will love you and give give your uh, give their all to you. And you are ready. Well, you might not be completely ready yet, women. But you're looking forward to manifesting that kind of energy into you. <clears throat> so that's your love reading, Aries. For the women, I do feel like... I do feel like you're, 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 more, you're sterner than the males for some reason. And that's why you're manifesting a king of pentacles. Someone who can really stand with you by you understand you not want to compete with you you know all that beautiful energy someone that will give you love so for the males they want to attract that femininity that nurturing caring energy of love and understanding and appreciation and kisses and <laughs> for the woman i feel like you're after that king who is intelligent who is a leader of worlds who will be able to hold you right who is in business who is intelligent who has spiritual gifts who is very successful as well i also feel like an aries could be attracting another aries right like two aries are coming together in this reading that's another possibility and it's a beautiful, it's a beautiful combination because I did say we have all these beautiful cards out here. We have the two of cups, which is twin flame soulmate energy and the lovers, which is twin flame soulmate energy as well. All right. So this is a very profound love reading. Um, thank you so much for listening, Aries, and I'll catch you next time. All the best to you. And if this video resonates with what is going on in your life. Please remember to subscribe to my channel and like this video and let me know what really resonates in the comment section. Thank you for tuning in and I will see you next time. Take care. Bye.